Hello out there. This is JA Yummy Mummy. It's bright and early in the morning and this is the wedding weekend. So I'm here today to do some pre-wedding prep. Uh, as per the bridezilla's request, we're going to do um, some like breakfast uh, tea sandwiches. Um, and today we're going to be doing two things. Corned beef sandwiches? Yes. Corned beef. This is like spam. I know. As a kid, I thought this was the best thing ever. Of course, as I've gotten older, I realized this is not that healthy, but it tastes so good. So we still use it. Um, so all you need for this is, it's the simplest um, like recipe I'm doing today. You need the corned beef, you need um, black pepper and seasoning, salt, bread. Um, I made a cheese sauce ahead of time. I actually did it um, over the week, last weekend, and now we've got extra leftovers. So I figured, oh, this was perfect. I'll do some cheese sandwiches, half cheese and half corned beef. Um, I've got uh, half of the onion that I already cut up. I cut up a quarter of it and then the other quarter I actually grated. And then, I, like I said, I've got the um, black pepper and the seasoning salt. I've got a half a teaspoon of seasoning salt and a teaspoon of black pepper, uh, coarsely crushed. Uh, the, um, see, uh, the, the canned meat, as usual, is full of sodium, so try not to add too much salt. But you can season to taste. I'm just telling you how much I put in. So let's get started. I left the label on and didn't open it because I want to show you guys sort of like a trick. So it comes with a little key on the side. And what I like to do is take the label off because when you're trying to open it, it can get all bunched up and make it like that much more difficult for you to open it. So I take off as much of it as I can. Some of it is still like glued to the can. You're gonna engage the key. So lock it onto the side and twist open. That's it. All right, so just get everything out. Okay. Oh, need a fork. Get rid of that. Okay. And you start to mix in your ingredients. So I just flatten it a little bit so I can work a little bit better. I decided to do two different types of onion because um, it is a wedding, so we don't want to be like super oniony on our breaths. So I'm gonna put like half of the quarter that is um, that is greater, and then I'm just gonna do half of the chopped up onion. I uh, know some of the bridesmaids are not gonna want too many chunks of onion, so that's why I said, well, let me do it both ways. Here goes the seasoning salt and the black pepper. Some people do actually put um, mayonnaise in too, but I'm not a huge fan of mayonnaise, but of course it's an option for you. And you just mix everything in. Super, super, super easy. You want it mixed well. There's enough, like to me, fat in here that you don't need the mayonnaise, like I said, but you could always um, add it additional if you want. Okay. Good. I'm going to taste it. Delicious. Okay. All right. So now we've got this done. I'm going to clean up my area and get right back. All right. So all that's left is for us to put the sandwiches together. So we are going to do one heaping tablespoon of our mixture <clears throat> with the corned beef, onions, um, the pepper, and the seasoning salt. Spread it on. Make a sandwich. I'm trying to do something cutesy, so let's see what we're going to do here. Maybe this and then this. That works. Not yes or no, cameraman. Cameraman says yes. So that way, and then yeah, works. All right. So I got my platter over here. I always like to do, even if it's with a paper towel or anything fancy, today. 
It's just late. Take the towel down. So I'll do half um, half cheese and half uh, corned beef. So we'll just run through these right now. And you'll see how super fast I'll get that done. Get one heaping. enough so this is something that anyone can do for any event that you're doing you want a quick easy like oh here am I able to offer you some hors d'oeuvres or, or something so here it is not hard to do at all um, uh, we want to thank you for joining us this is JA yummy mommy and I'm gonna keep you posted throughout the day on all the wedding activities uh, it's the crack of dawn and I have to go put on makeup and get my hair done and all that fun stuff so you guys will get to share with us uh, that whole experience too thanks bye